If we talk about crowd economy, number one P is people. It's driven by the winds of the five meta trends. This isn't going anywhere. Remember those e-commerce curves and those social media curves? We're going to have a crowd curve that looks the exact same way. I think this is one of our big mental challenges that we need to get over with all this crowd stuff is to really understand the power of things at large scale. So these 72 tweets that the crowd is tagged as urgent need look similar because of these different patterns. I really like the concept of crowd economy because we're not talking only about sourcing, funding, but we are talking about the structure change. A lot of crowdfunding, crowdsourcing is on-demand self-service. Part of what we wanted to do was to create a platform where we can take this engaged community, bottom-up civic engagement, and put it with top-down government workflows. Now we've got this amazing thing that we all talk about, the crowd, and ordinary people that make up this crowd, people like you and I, can actually make a difference. You know, everybody says India is the third largest social media uh, country, which means what? Which means nothing to us. If you ask me, 90% do not have any connectivity. But that 10% is bloody so much that they are largest in the world.